welcome back everyone to the channel. I do not have sourdough. Um, so I picked up a loaf of sourdough bread and I'm going to show you how to make the most amazing um, grilled cheese. So, nonstick pan. I'm going to turn it on. I honest to goodness think that when you have a grilled cheese, on sourdough bread. You will never go back to just having it on regular bread. Look at how great these slices look. Oh, this is gonna be a good one. Okay, so I have the stove on. Let me just see, if, make sure you can see me. I'm gonna get some butter. And the first thing I'm going to do is put some butter in my frying pan. And then I'm going to take some softened butter and I'm going to start smearing it on the sourdough bread. Hopefully it's soft enough. We will see. You just want to smear it all over. You don't have to be chinzy. And now I'm going to do the other half of my bread. Or the other piece, I should say, with some sourdough. I mean, with some butter on my sourdough. Let's try saying that five times. Butter starting to melt in the pan. You can use any cheese you want. You can use multiple different cheeses. I might stay with American today, I'm not a thousand percent sure because I like all cheeses. Okay, there's the bread. Wait, let me hold that so you can see it right. There's the bread, both buttered, and the pan is starting to melt. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one side that's buttered, but I'm going to put it face down. I think I'm going to, let's see, and then I'm going to put American cheese on that part first. And then what other cheese do I want to do? Let's see here. Um, I think I'm going to cut some of this cheese up. This is Asagio, Asagio, however you pronounce it. Apparently I said it wrong the last time. I'm just going to start doing some slices. We're going to need a lot more than this. I'm just going to start putting it all over. I'm going to turn that down so I get more sliced. A cheese slicer, I think. There we go. And then I'm going to take um, the butter side from the other piece and I'm going to put it right on top, like so. Push it down. 
going to get a spatula. so good. Now, I'm going to turn the heat back up some because I lowered it. My grandson, Gavin, is addicted to his mom mom's grilled cheese. And this is why this is the one that I make him as well. If you want, you can take a little bit more butter. And you can go over the top piece, just smear it. And I'm telling you, the crunch that you get from sourdough grilled cheese is amazing. You can use cheddar cheese, you can use any cheese that you like. Flip it. Mm, look at that goodness. So I definitely am not, I mean, I tried before I moved out of my own home um, to make some sourdough. And um, yeah, I need some practice in that field a little bit more. So, I don't have sourdough. Like I said, I bought that sourdough. And um, it makes the best grilled cheese. You can do cheddar cheese, um, apple smoked. You can use mozzarella. You can use whatever your heart's desired. The world is your pickle. I know I just have a tendency to say the one cheese wrong. Asagio? I don't know. American and Asagio, that's what I used. Um, correct me down below, besides Jay, on how to actually pronounce that cheese, but it is one of my faves. We are looking pretty good. We are almost there. Doesn't take very long. And you're going to get that, that crunch. Oh. Another minute or two, and that will be done. I usually like to eat it on the side with an arugula salad. Sometimes I'll eat it just like this. So, I did have... Someone asked me, you know, I had a simple video, which was how do I make egg salad? And I got a video on how do you make a grilled cheese? Honest to goodness, I never use white bread anymore. I only make grilled cheese from sourdough bread. So here I am making the video to show you how I make my sourdough grilled cheese. I'm going to give that another minute or two. Just give it a little squeeze. And I think this pan boy is done. Okay, let me get a different plate. Definitely not using that plate.
Clean white plate. table so that you can hear and see the crunch. Listen to that crunch. Oh, that's amazing. And there you have it. That is how I make my sourdough grilled cheese, just like so. Um, super duper easy. If you make sourdough, well, then you're even better off because you will have unlimited amount of sourdough bread, which is my favorite. So sourdough grilled cheese sandwich. There you go. Let me show you the inside again. Look at that yumminess. Let me take a bite. Mmm. Hot. The crunch is amazing. You'll never go back to this regular white bread or your grilled cheese. So there you have it. That is how I make my grilled cheese. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below if you haven't subscribed already. Doesn't cost you anything. Go on and hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you on the next video. God bless.